In the context of Australia, there's a history that is very rich, rich and promising around the special broadcasting service. And there's a, an understanding of multicultural diversity that in some ways is actually very similar to what took root here. Of course, though, that history comes with a caveat, which is to say a public broadcaster is subject to the whims with regard to funding of government changes over time. And so building something fantastic that risks being unfunded over time is a significant danger, right? And so um, there's things that you, so, so making a CBC, but for ethnocultural minorities is a good idea, except when it comes into so far as we see this right now with the CBC budget. The idea that the CBC budget should be um, reduced in radical ways that may affect its ability to serve the Canadian people across, no matter how far flung across the territory is, 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 is always a risk there. In the context of the United States, absolutely. It shows one of the ways that scale can radically affect access to content, right? It is a much bigger place, so much bigger that it's almost hard to imagine some of the things that are capable of happening in the US context being easily and directly translated into the Canadian context.